What's up guys, welcome to your daily dose of Joseph. I'm your host, Joseph Chasty Mantendo, and we are here playing Mirror's Edge. And it's that awkward moment when you realize in the last episode all you did was talk about some guy getting his legs knocked off in a parachuting accident. And uh, it get uh, and messing up your scent and then the Okay, you know, I'm not even gonna finish that joke, like for real. <laughs> um that joke's over. I I killed it. <laughs> um alright. Crap. Oh god, no! <laughs> I'm so stupid! Oh Joseph, why? But um so yeah, that guy over there, he's a dick. I don't like him calling me Faithy. That's awkward. It's like, man, get out of my life. You ain't my homes. Oh my gosh! Gosh, I never used that phrase. That's that's a difference for me. Whoa. How did I not take damage? Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Oh my god. Okay, okay, there should be an opening, like right up in here, to get in. I know what you're here for, Faithy. Just tell me what Icarus has to do with Pope's murder, Jack. I heard a cop did it. You heard wrong, then. You a fan of wrestling, Faith? Pope was a wrestling fan. He even employed an ex-wrestler to handle his security. Travis Burfield used to go by the name of Ropeburn. Is this going somewhere? Ropeburn? Well, he's really just a thug who got lucky. And sometimes people are too ignorant to see their place. Always want to swim in the big pond. Never see the bigger fish. If I were you, I'd start with a glorified slab of meat. Happy hunting, Faithy. Listen, I don't know about going to Ropeburn straight away. I'm not. I'm gonna see Mel. Oh, Faith, what are you doing? You gonna tell him about Jackknife? Not yet. He's still a cop. No matter what Kate says. You see him? Yeah. He's heading for his car. Lieutenant Miller? I'm Faith. Kate's sister? She never mentioned a sister. Yeah, well, we're not the mentioning kind. She told me to find you if things went bad. She's been arrested. And you wouldn't be the suspect seen fleeing from the crime scene, would you? Well now, it's difficult to recall with a gun in my face. I know what you are. You know it was a setup, right? I know Kate wouldn't be capable of something like this. But my captain's asking some difficult questions, and I can't even get in to see her. What do you know about something called Icarus? Why? It's mentioned on this. It was in Pope's hand. I think it's from his diary. You took evidence. Kate's the only family I have, Lieutenant. And Blue's in jail don't last long. She goes down for this. It's a death sentence. I won't stop you. I owe that much to Kate. But there are plenty of people who'll try. And I can't stop them either. You better learn how to run. Running is what I do best. Rope Burns got an office at Sea Burfield International Shipping near the Riding Park subway. Should be a sign on top of the building. It'll help guide you. Look, I saw Rope Burn wrestle once. Broke some poor bastard's arm, then headbutted the ref. So if this rope burn really is mixed up with Pope's murder and Kate's setup, then he sure won't be a talker. He'll be a fighter. Well, I'm looking forward to meeting him. He run up the. Oh man, that could have been so smooth. Um. So apparently, we got a friend inside the agency that we can uh. Okay, I have a feeling that was not the direction I was supposed to go. <laughs> um, I put barbed wire up for a reason, you know. <clears throat> uh, I was talking about something. 
uh, something with words using the English language. Why is it that I'm able to use my tongue, my teeth, my vocal cords, just these random things to make noise? I mean, it's fine that I'm able to make noise, and it's perfectly acceptable. But why is it I can make noise that you can comprehend and merge, and you you just somehow translate all this gibberish that's coming out of my mouth? And I'll probably mind after you, or mind rape. It should be called mind rape because it was forceful and it was not wanted, I'm sure. Um, it's like, ah, uh, just why? Why? Why are we able to make sense of what. No! <coughs> um, uh, what we're saying. Like, why is it that me making these noises it come out in a way that you can comprehend? It doesn't make much sense, like, at all. Like, uh, just why? Why is it you're perfectly capable of putting this together? Why did we just randomly... Why is it these noises exist? Why do, did we decide this noise means this? This noise means this. I mean... Uh, what's it called? I can go back to, I think, the Tower of Babylon, I think it is? Where, oh, oh. Uh, myself over the freaking okay okay darkness get out of the darkness <clears throat> I guess it could go back to the Tower of Babylon I think it's called is um which would make sense because it's like those programs called Babylon and stuff that are like for uh, learning uh, different languages where um, everybody spoke one language and then to um, to get rid of the uh, I forget, I think it was that the people were making a tower to God, and God did not want the, uh, the, the, the tower, so, um, for our own safety, uh, he broke our voices, basically, and made it so we all spoke different languages, and we couldn't work together anymore, so, and that's what led to the split up of our culture, I guess, and, um, oh, oh, hello! <laughs> ooh, ooh, ooh. I have a feeling it'll be like back here or something. Um, okay, that's no, that's the right way to go. And I mean, yeah, it can go back to that, but it's still, it just feels uncomfortable. It's like this, the okay, tower with night and day, I guess. Um,. It's just uncomfortable to think about. I'm making noises. Your brain is putting them together and comprehending them. Why is your brain that powerful? It, I just don't like it. <laughs> I wish I wish we were a lot more primal. I wish we were like my cat that I just randomly saw eating a... Um, <laughs> I'm assuming it was either a very, very... Uh, oh, oh, I failed. <laughs> it was either a very, very, very... Uh, light lizard or a very 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 dark cricket that <laughs> she was eating on the porch um okay I just do what I'm told you know that yeah well I don't know what you do I uh, facilitated things and I got more folks watching me than just you and they wanted us to wrap her up all night for those yeah, yeah, so we don't look good for you and your little gang. Take that up with them. In a few days, it'll all be over. Today's front page will be tomorrow's kitty litter. Come on! That runner won't last long. None of them will, right? The precious Project Icarus will be fine. Bye bye bye! Now, don't get your panties in a bunch. Look, meet me at that new place on Reynolds Street tomorrow. 4 p.m., okay? Don't freak! They ain't finished building it yet. All quiet once you get above street level. See you there. And don't bring any of your friends. We good? Good. Anyways, I gotta get some chow. Frame like this don't hold up itself, you know. <laughs> Burn did know something, huh? Wonder who he's meeting with. 
Get back here and we'll find a way to make you an uninvited guest. Hey, look sharp. I'm getting blues heading for you. You must have turned the silence. <laughs> well then, I guess I'm gonna have to get going. So I will see you guys next time.